GoTrax killed it with this scooter. It is so smooth, very fast, has that speed giddy up that you want, but it's like, let's just check it out. Let's look into all the functions and features. So I'm just gonna kind of start it here at the top and work my way down to the back. So starting off, handles, very ergonomic and super comfy. I really like them. It has this grip right here. So that some others, like when you kind of get sweaty if you've been going for a long time, I swear your hands like fall off. It has these grips right here on the end so your hands don't slip off. I do like that. You got front and back brake versus just one or the other. Really, really like that. As well as it has a light on the front, which you can adjust up and down. And on the light itself, it has a reflector, which is really nice. So say maybe the light gives out or anything like that, which it should, and it should just last, honestly, forever. But you got the reflector right there as well as a reflector on the back. So that's kind of everything going on right here. You got two different things right here. You got this guy right here, which this is the throttle. So when you push this down, it's gonna go. And then you got this one, I'll show you here in a sec. That's where you flip it down. But to turn it on, you hold the power button down for about, about three seconds and it beeps showing you that you're turned on. Now you can have an, a lock system on it so that some, like no one can get away with this and they can't use it unless they have your code, a three digit code. Or you can turn it off so you just turn it on and get going. But I'm just gonna put the code in right now, which is kind of just the standard one and then it turns right on. Now, when you're looking at the screen, it might be flashing just because that's what happens with like a phone and a screen sometimes. Itself is not actually flashing, just know that that's the phone doing that right now. But it shows your miles per hour, you can go from like kind of cruise mode, you can go into sport mode, you can even go into a walking mode. What's really cool about the walking mode is this thing, it's got a big battery, it's got some power behind it. So it's got some weight, and if you're just wanting to kind of walk around town or if you're like in the city or something like that and you're just wanting to walk with it, and you're not riding it, it's really nice to be able to have this like little umph of, it'll just go about two, three miles per hour and it takes the weight off of it because it's actually going with you, which is really, really nice. So other than that, it shows your battery level and it shows your odometer of how far you've gone. Hold it for another three seconds and it's off. So you also have cruise control on this. So if you hold this throttle down all the way for 10 seconds, it enters cruise control. So you don't have to worry about that. It just keeps going all by itself. Another cool thing, let me show you guys this. This thing folds down so easy. So here on the front, all you have to do is you just flip this up, you pull down and you take this down. And then this is the part that's gonna clip right into it, just like that. And then it's as simple as that. Now you're ready to go and you can just walk around town. It's just easy to transport. You can put it in the back of your car. You don't have to have a truck or anything like that. It's just super easy. So it's as simple as just putting that right back down, popping it back up, locking it into place and you're done. You do have a kickstand, which is really nice. I like that the kickstand is nice and durable, very easy to be able to just set it right up. I like that. When you turn on the scooter, it does have these cool blue LEDs on the bottom. I'll show you what they look like at night. This thing looks very futuristic, which is really cool. I'm gonna just turn it right back off. But the motor is actually the one here on the back. This wheel is where the motor is. It has dual suspension. It has fork on the front, has spring in the back, has a reflector. When you brake, it actually shows that the lights are turning on so people know that you're braking. With these big pneumatic tires, it is so smooth. You can adjust the brakes to be able to, however you want, like on the front and the back, just by twisting this. This thing is so nice. It has a really long range. It feels high quality is the best way to put it. It doesn't feel like things are rattling or anything like that. So stinking nice. I love it. Have a great time, guys. To be able to charge it, it comes with the charger, which is super nice. All you do is you pull this guy out right here, you insert, and it will be charging. What's really nice about it is that when you're charging, It'll be showing this light when it's plugged in, if it's gonna be red or green, if it's fully charged, that's very nice to be able to know, as well as it comes with this attachment, which is an attachment that you can put into uh, any like you know pump that you have to be able to inflate tires. What's nice is the fact that it's bendable and it can just connect really easily to be able to pump right into the tires. You don't need to use this that often because it holds air super well. At nighttime, this underglow looks really, really nice. I think it also gives a great, like, you know, letting people know that you're there, which is great, not just from the headlight, but also from the underglow. Looks really cool. But another thing that I cannot stress enough about this scooter is how smooth it is. With the big pneumatic tires and the springs that they have on this thing, and just the build quality, it feels so nice. Just riding on it, you can tell that the build quality, as far as, like, the components that they used, very high quality. I love it, and I hope you guys have a great time.